All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video of Far Cry 6. I hope everyone enjoyed our last two videos. And this one... Good, you're here. We are going to talk to Clara, see what's up. I don't need to tell you that Viviro is the lifeblood of Castillo's regime. He's built work camps to produce it all over Yara. These plantations use outcasts as slaves to grow the tobacco plants they turn into Viviro. These are our people, Danny. Beaten, tortured, sprayed by poison chemicals. There's a camp on this island. We tried to destroy it when we invaded. We failed. Now we're going to finish the job. Julio is waiting for you at a nearby barn. All right, follow Julio's lead and destroy that Viviro prison camp, Danny. Okay, you and Julio are going to attack the prison camp. Burn it to the ground with the... Supremo Juan gave you. You need to hit Castillo where it hurts and send a message that Libertad is still in the fight. Hit that slave camp hard. Suerte. All right. So let's see what this was right next to her. Get out of the way, Wapo. Let's see. Read. All right. Printed field notes. The invasion was a failure. Losing air support that early in the attack didn't help. But it was over when the Navy spotted our ship before we could even reach land. It's clear Libertad needs to learn how to fight and also how to fail. Not every battle is going to lead to victory and we can't just fall apart like this. I've been dreaming of my papa. He doesn't say anything. He never said a lot to me when I was awake. Why would he start now? I see him standing in the camp and he just gives me that look. The one he gave me the first time I got arrested for protesting. Fuck him. <laughs> if I see him in my dreams again tonight, I'm going to start shooting. What I wouldn't give for a win right now. All right. Poor kid. All right. Meet Julio. He's waiting for me in Perez Farms. Okay. Sure wish we had a vehicle. We have to go all the way here. Gran Goretto Maguettes. And Buena Vista Beach. Okay. Is there horses around here? Right there has to be. In last video, we got a horse around here. Hopefully. Yeah, there it is. Hola, guerrilla. Time for a test drive of that Supremo. Now, if things get too heavy with the soldados, just pull the trigger. But one tiny, tiny thing you should know. Uh-huh. The Supremos are in an experimental phase. They need time to breathe after you use them. You know, so they don't overload and kill you. Could have told me before I strap one to my back. Just let that Supremo feed off the blood of your enemies. What? <laughs> You'll get it, Danny. <laughs> You'll get it. Real funny. Whoa, now. Supremos are powerful devices built by Juan that offer unique abilities. All right, let's see this. Oh, shit. Look at that. Supremos come with unique abilities. Trigger your Supremo. Taking out soldiers will recharge this Supremo much faster. Pretty cool. Power up. Okay, so we have to keep heading this way. And it's gonna take a while. Actually, no. We're right there. Super speed horse. Yeah, here we go. Oh, I can feel it in the controller. Pretty cool. Go! Whoops, I keep doing pressing B. Get off the horse. Didn't think you'd show. Listen, I'm not going to bullshit you. I wanted to do this alone, but Clara gave me an order. I can handle myself. Don't give a shit. So could Lita. She should be here right now, but instead, I get you. And I'm supposed to be in Miami. But instead, my two best friends are dead, and I'm stuck here with you. So, truce? Enough talk. Step one, we hit the tobacco. Step two, we destroy their poison supply. Step three, we get the fuck out of there, and Castillo gets a nice pretty message from Libertad. Got it. Take this gear. It'll protect you from fire, and more importantly, Castillo's fucking poison. All right. He was the one that taught us to shut up. Oh, shit. We go mitts. All right, let's see that wrist armor. Oh, what? Oh, shit. Yeah, I look sick. Okay. Oh, never mind. Wait, hold up. 
That's pretty cool. Headgear, chest gear. Oh, cool. Where's the, uh, where's the mitts? Thought we had mitts. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, I got the watch in the last video. Let's see what this does. When I'm fire, the flames are all in my foot up. Yeah, that would be pretty sick. I get on fire a lot. Oh, yeah. Okay, I got an idea. Let's get rid of this rifle. Let's put in the toaster. Yeah, the flamethrower, ladies and gentlemen. It's gonna be cool. So we have an assault rifle, a reservoir weapon, we have a sniper, and then we have a, uh, a pistol. I think we're good. Using the right protective gear in the right situation will keep you alive. Yeah, the right tool for the right job. Mm, been hearing that a lot lately. Listen, Julio. Lita was like a sister to me. There are no other chains here. She died because of you. Yes. No. Anton Castillo killed Lita. If I could change anything, it would be me dying on that beach. Lita was a better person than I could ever be. And if she loved you, well, that just says a lot about who you are. Enough. Look, if you and I are going to do this, we need to know about the poison. You mean that shit they spray on the leaves? Its real name is PG-240, but we call it the poison because it fucked up your system. Try not to breathe it or get it on your skin. It can make you go fucking crazy or sick, like deep down sick. And if that doesn't get you, the cancer that grows inside you will. Gonya. So you're military. Marksman? Close us off? What's your thing? I'm good with guns. We get along. We'll start thinking. That gear I gave you was good for fire and poison, but guerrillas need gear that fits their style, no matter the situation, or they get themselves killed. This is a good place to scout it. Right behind you. Let's see what we're up against. Well, that's pretty cool. They have stuff that can fit our play style. Up here, Dali. We don't need the workbench right now. So far, the gameplay in this is pretty good. It does feel a little different than the previous games. See the Viviro tobacco and the yellow poison tanks? See. Si. Punch holes in the tanks to let the poison out into the air. Fun fact. Poison and fire make a hell of a mix. Big boom. Same idea with the fumigators. They're hard to kill, but they can't take the heat. You've got a flamethrower. You've got that Supremo. Time to fuck up all this Viviro bullshit. Yeah. You know, Lita and I had a ritual. Psych us up before battle. A song. Hit me. El movimiento de libertad. Oh, bella ciao, bella ciao. Bella ciao, ciao, ciao. <laughs> For Lita. Yeah. For Lita. For Let's Lita. make some chaos, Danny. Yeah, here we go. Are we going in guns blazing? Okay. Go, go, go. What are you doing now? Okay. I could destroy the yellow poison tanks with explosives. I can burn the red back with my toaster. Residents of Santuario Island, there is a viper in your midst. Get the weapon. We'll burn oh, shit. the place to the ground. Oh, look at this. Sweet. Yeah. Oh, look at this guy going on fire. Pretty sick music.
Here's the alarm. Let's take it out. Music. <laughs> Get out of here. Oh shit, he's down. Destroy it all. It's the same with vibes. Okay, so we still have to destroy them. Oh, I don't want to burn the dog. I can't do that. Oh shit, I'm so sorry. We do this. Uh, oh shit. Yeah. All right, so we got to do that. I got an idea, let's get up here. Oh shit, here we go. Yeah! Oh, I just killed them both. What? The Supremo is fucking perfect. Where is he? Oof. Alright, then it all catches on fire, right? There we go. Don't go in there, Wapo. I think we did it, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. On my way. Huh. Learning shit with a flamethrower? Felt familiar. Pretty cool.
I was pretty sick. The Slaver's Tower. This watchtower was built in the 19th century to watch over the slaves working in the surrounding fields. The guards posted here weren't for the slaves' protection. They were here to make sure there were no escapes. This watchtower is only the most recent one to stand on this site. There were three more built over the centuries, all destroyed in revolts. This tower has been preserved in its present form in hope that no yarns will ever be slaves again. <laughs> Sir. Sure, whatever you say. There he is. Come on, get back here. Oh yeah. Motherfuckers. <laughs> Shit, you really can hold your own. I don't want to say I told you so, but... Look, we should move. That was a hell of a light show, and they're going to see the smoke. We work well together. See, si. listen, if you were good with Lita, you're good with me. Gracias, Danny. Meet you back at camp. Cool. All right. That was a good mission. Fire and Fury. Operation completed. Oye, Clara. I hope you can see the smoke from where you are. You struck a blow against Castillo today. I hope Julio wasn't too rough on you. He's hurting, but okay. I think Lita would be smiling right now. Danny, there's someone I want you to meet. His name is Benito. He's a local fisherman, which means boats for Libertad. He lives on the east side of Casas Cove. Always got time to make new friends. You're building bridges for me, Danny. It's your gift. We need Benito. Talk to him. All right, so talk to Benito. So I believe we're going to talk to the, the man of the hour in the next video. Hope everyone enjoyed it. Out to great video so far. We burnt all the Vivido. I will call it burning the Vivido. So hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to drop a like on the video and consider subscribing because we're the, I was just about to say, we're the only channel on the internet. But that's for the Halo Saga. But if you enjoyed it, consider subscribing for more great videos just like this. And uh, consider writing in the comments if you would like to, for me to make the videos longer or shorter. Because I'm down to do anything that you guys want. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys next video, baby.